identified a teenager and a 20 year old killed in a dirt bike crash late last night. NBC 10's Jody Reed is in Wareham for us tonight and she spoke to eyewitnesses about what happened. Jody. It was just before 11 o'clock at night when a driver told us she was traveling home on Marion Road when two boys on a dirt bike went zipping by her. She said when she saw a car turn left onto Gibbs Avenue, she knew what would happen next was going to be tragic. And they just collided and I got out of my car. It was just a horrifying scene. It was just horrifying. Jahada Gonzalez said she stayed with the boys until the police came. They're just laying there asking for help. I've seen the whole thing happen right in front of my eyes. 17 year old Robert Stalker of Woburn and 20 year old Brady Petrucci of Rainham were rushed to a nearby hospital where they were pronounced dead. Police believe the two boys were riding a Kawasaki dirt bike and were not wearing helmets when they collided with an SUV. Investigators say there were no front or rear lights on the dirt bike, making it hard to see at night. The driver of the 2017 Buick Envision that hit the bike stopped immediately and stayed on scene. A memorial has been set up for Brady and Bobby along Marion Road. People have been coming by all day long to drop off flowers in their honor, including Jihada, who said what she witnessed Saturday night will change her life forever. My heart just goes out to those families because it's really heartbreaking. I have four kids of my own not knowing where they are. They're not from here. You know, they're from Rainham and Woburn and not knowing where your kids are at. It's, it's really, it shook me to my core. The crash is now being investigated by the Plymouth County District Attorney's Office. He has not said yet whether charges will be filed in this crash. In Wareham, Jody Reed, NBC 10 News. Hi everyone, it's Mario Florio from NBC 10. Thanks for checking out the NBC 10 WJAR YouTube channel. Click the links on your screen for more stories from across Southern New England. And don't forget, hit the subscribe button below and get notified anytime we post an update on YouTube. As always, thank you for turning to 10.